it's always maximize exposure to sunlight in the first half of the day. Number one thing for just making sure that you sleep well that night. And then mm. limiting artificial light exposure by dimming lights from 10 p.m. to 4 a.m. Very few people do those two things, but they have an outsized effect on sleep. And there's a really nice study out of Israel this last year that showed that if you had people, this was men and women, go outside for 20 minutes, three times a week, and try and expose as much of their skin as they possibly could to sunlight while still being decent, all right? that it raised testosterone and estrogen significantly. Why? Because skin isn't just an organ to you know tattoo and protect our organs. It's a organ that actually functions as an endocrine, as a hormone organ, that, like vitamin D, right? Mm -hmm. This kind of thing. And there was this whole pathway that they delineated in this study, really interesting, based on keratinocytes, which are these particular skin cells, and P53, which is a cell cycle molecule. Super interesting, it showed getting sunlight on your body 